the excitement and fireworks building here, Atlantic Lottery Corporation and Canada 150 in memory of Shelly Gass. It's the first of four in the fifth and final leg of the World Driving Championship at Historic Driving Park in Charlottetown. The Metro Home Building Center starting gate is rolling. They're going a mile and a sixteenth. Have fun with it, Vance Cameron. Thank you, Ken Larkin did. They're lining up in the World Driving Championship. Libby Beans, big in crashes. Ari's Nancy Americwell, Jingle Rider One Hard Bet, Formidable, Maldale Mac in the Frontier. The back tier, Johanna's Jet, White Sand Artist, Jay's Little Spark. Folks, you may never see it here in Charlotte Down, but we're mighty proud to have the final leg of the World Driving Championship. Folks, time. There they go. They're up and pacing as they get away. Offside is big and precious. Going to the lead is Jingle Rider. Towards the rail, that is Ari's Nancy. From the outside for third, into the turn is Mardell Mack. Then on the inside, fourth goes Libby Bean. Up on the outside and racing from fifth, that's Americwell. Six towards the rail, going to the back stretch. That is White Sand Artist. Then racing along the inside and facing from seventh, Johannes Jet. So they race the back stretch for time one. Marcus Miller and Maudale Mack. Jingle Rider and Bjorn Goop. Set to take over. Boom! Just like that. Wow! 27 3! They opened it up. It's Jingle Rider on the lead. Americ well on the outside. Now second. Maudale Mack at the rail third. Fourth on the outside. That's Libby Beans on the rail fifth. Ari's Nancy. Six at the inside. Run there on the inside is White Sand Artist. Jay's a little spark on the outside. Then towards the rail. As they move into the turn, is Johanna's Jet. The opening half mile was 58 and 1. Up the back stretch now for the final time. Jingle Rider for Bjorn Gold. Clear by two. Second towards the rail. Maudel Mack and Marcus Miller racing from third. Harvey's Nancy and Dexter Dunn. They're coming three and four. Wide now, three quarters of a mile. They were there in one, 27 and four. And it's all Jingle Rider for Beyond Goop. The battle is shaping up for the deuce in here. Homeward bound they come. Jingle Rider is home and cold. Jay's a little spark, formidable late. It's Jingle Rider and Sweden's Beyond Goop. Toe in it here. Tight for the deuce. Jay's a little spark up against Formidable. And they were at the mile in 157 and 2. The mile in 116, 205 flat. All right, Greg, here comes the slow-mo for you off the top turn here tonight in the uh, first race of the final leg here tonight. We talked about this horse, Jingle Rider, in the pre-race, and, uh, boy, he was uh, he was good tonight. Yeah, sure was. Um, daughter of a sports rider has just raced away. Bjorn Goop had that race in his keeping, a, a lap from home. The horses all around him were struggling. He had a lap full of horse and dashing for home. The, uh, the mare's raced right away and, and won quite convincingly. That's the 17th win of her career. Ontario Racing would like to welcome everyone to the World Trotting Conference and the World Driving Championship. Ontario Racing Association is the voice for the Ontario horse racing industry, building a strong foundation for a Here's vibrant betting future. Line on the outside, right on the money to win. Betting line wins the super final. Panel Island Flyer Rock and McKittian from the outside looking to be iconic. 
Channel Island Flyer Winter. But she is poetry in motion. Holy Helena. And she's won it by three lengths. Three breeds, one vision. This is Ontario Racing. Well, making their way back to the winner's circle tonight. And our sponsors uh, for tonight, Atlantic Lottery Corporation, along with Canada 150 in memory of Shelley Gass and uh, the Honorable Heath McDonald, the Minister of Tourism and Economic Development, will be trackside along with uh, the Managing Director for Red Shores, Mr. Michael McKinnon, making the cooler presentation. Vance? Jingle Rider arriving at the third race. Winner's Circle, the Bay Pacing Mayor, the five year old daughter of Sport Rider, is from the Rustler Hanover Dam Village Jangle. Owned by Alex McPhee of Pride River, trained by Ronnie Gass. Sweden's Bjorn Goop is in the driver's seat for his Charlottetown win. The mile and one sixteenth was race timed in 205. Congratulations. Jingle Rider taking out race number three, driven by Bjorn Goop. And that was a, uh, a pretty easy win for you in the end? Yeah, let's just say it was the best horse in the field, for sure. It was a really nice horse to drive, and it was yeah, gate speed and stamina too, so it was quite easy to be a driver. With a lap to go, it looked as though uh, you, were, you were the winner. You were, you were travelling a lot better than your rivals. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I wanted to win, that's for sure. <laughs> and what about uh, the week? How's it been for you? It's been a while between wins, but you've been having a good time? Yes, extremely fun. We're a big group of people traveling around and we're actually having so much fun. You know, it's like, it's not that important, the results. Of course, you want to win. I've been a little bit unlucky with the draws and stuff like that. But in the end, the things you will remember for the future is always like uh, those friends you got along in those trip. And it's been amazing. It's a, such a super group. All everyone's like losing races. They're still like cheering up for the winners. So it's been really, really fun. Congratulations on the win. Well done. Thank you so much. There he is, Bjorn Goop, the driver of a Jingle Rider taking out race number three.